out sometimes you're going to find out that it's all tangled up like this at the bottom that's where it keeps rubbing at the back of our necks or the chains or your coat so it's always going to be the rough place so i always start from sorting out my my wig caps from the bottom it's always going to be like this i don't know why but so what i'll do is i'll wet it up i'll wet it up like that What's it all up? Now, because this is a colored wig, if you're gonna wet it with conditioner, which is advisable, I always say, because it's color, the conditioner is gonna penetrate through the, the cuticles of the hair. So some of the color might come out. Uh -huh. So that's it. So wet it all up nicely. So with the conditioner, like I said, it will penetrate through into the cuticle. So you might find that some of the color will come out. So wet it all up. Like that. Like so. You just need a little bit of water, but I, I'm very particular with my hair, the way I want it to appear. So. And the edges also, the edges need to be wet. <laughs> oh God, all the dining table wet. Mm -hmm. So that's done. And then I'll put some coconut oil. Or any oil of your choice. But I like coconut oil because it melts easily so it wouldn't just clump up somewhere and it shines and i love the smell of coconut anyway and i start to brush it out okay, so it's easy to brush out you always have to brush each line don't just assume it's not going to tangle. It won't look nice if the front is nicely looking and the back is not nicely looking. So always brush it up. Brush, brush, brush. So all this is ready to go. Now I realize that this is loose. So as you can see, this is can't find my needle, don't know what to do. So all you do is take this and this and you just tie up together. Just so that you won't see as red because of the reddish tone. It's stained on the the, 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 um, the closure so I just put this on just to mimic my own to my complexion I just apply this I push my stuff and tap backwards So now, because mine is a bit white hair, so I'm going to cover it up. So I'll pull some of the hair. hair. So we'll start from, this is how we wrap it. When we're going to keep it in the closet somewhere. So you just wrap it up like that. Tuck it all in. And then you can put it in a bag. If you don't have a doll head. Yeah, so here's my finished look. I prefer the side part today. Please don't forget, this is Mongolian Kinky Jerry 1B 99 day. And um, it's been now for about three years, washed it, touched it up. And we provide that service also in the shop so we can put all your hair on wig caps and we can touch up the color for you, make it more vibrant and you can keep using it. So here it is. And it's got movement this time. The first time I used this wig, it didn't have any movement, so I hated it. So now that they've washed it, touched it up, conditioned and all that, 
it's lovely and I won't put too many products in it I think that's what happened the last time so no not I'm not I'm gonna avoid putting too many products on it and wash it more often the more you wash it the more it becomes so excellent and very very friendly to use don't forget to subscribe to us go on our website victoriacole.co.uk buy your hair from us next day delivery as usual and if you have any complaints or anything you want to tell us to improve our services please whatsapp or send us an email bye bye bye, bye.